Hi, are you having problems with your VPN not working with ITVX? It's kind of common nowadays. Um, most of the big media sites have been um, blocking on down, cutting down on the use of VPNs and um, blocking their IP addresses and their connections. Um, basically, if you're having problems with your VPN, there's there's two main reasons. One, IP addresses are overloaded, so that um, there's too many people using a particular IP address to connect to a media site. So if you've got two and a half thousand people streaming Coronation Street from ITVX on a single IP address, which is quite common with a popular um, VPN, uh, it's going to get blocked because it's so completely obvious it's a VPN or a proxy server. Not that many people share IP addresses to that extent. Uh, you'll get a message like this on screen, error code 0101, similar to the code, um, it's quite a generic error that one, similar to the code if you get, if you connect with an IP address from another uh, country. Um, you'll also get um, an error 10-06, which is the more common one, which is basically detected you've got a VPN. So it doesn't care where you are, it thinks you're using a VPN, it's spotted one of these IP addresses, it's blacklisted, and it won't let you on. Um, so, what can we do about it? Well, let me just show you an example here. Um, I'm using NordVPN, which actually works really, really well with um, uh, ITVX and BBC iPlayer. But, it's got hundreds of IP addresses in the UK, but they don't all work with... Um, ITVX, as you can see, I'm getting the error message from one generic UK server there. I'm just going to disconnect here now. Uh, and that's because that IP address is basically being spotted. Uh, now, NordVPN um, has made some servers optimized for using these streaming sites. So what it's done, it's given a little, instead of optimizing all of them for um, BBC iPlayer and ITVX, it's just minimum, it's, it's, it's got about 40 servers, which uh, will work with those media sites. It's optimized these servers. Um, you can see here, these are the names, what, 1840 to 1847, 19, any of these, yeah, and in between, so that's 1850 to 1863, so it's 51, 52, 53, and so on. It's about 40 servers there. Um, those are the ones you should use if you're using NordVPN anyway. Um, I, the other streaming sites may have optimized. I don't think they do, but um, some try and optimize all of their servers, which usually ends up not working. So, so let's just uh, minimize this, and we'll go and reconnect to the IP server using one of those. Um, IP address. Okay, so let's just um, oh, I just need to close. That. Let's just go to NordVPN again, and what we'll do is we'll go to one of those servers. 1840 was one of them. Um, all you do is you just type in the number there. So 1845 was one, I think, and you'll you'll see the servers there. Just type in the number. You don't need to put in the location because you'll see it's a United Kingdom server. So we're connected there. So I'm connected to one of these. Um, BBC iPlayer optimized servers. Now, I know I say BBC iPlayer, this is ITVX, but they do the same things. They've optimized it for UK streaming sites, really. And, uh, and what they do is keep the number of connections down. Doesn't always work, but 90% uh, of the time this works for um, ITVX and BBC iPlayer if you use with NordVPN. Um, very, very occasionally I'll have one blocked, but... Um, if I use one of the optimized servers, hardly ever. Okay, so let's just show you. I was blocked with the other um, one, uh, but these are one of the optimized servers. So, hopefully, let's just go and I'm on ITVX now. Let's click on Red Eye. What's this? Um, series one, episode one. Parental controls are off. And here you can see it streaming. I hope you can see it there. Um, we're going through adverts now, but you get the 1006 and the 0101 error before this, so this is all working, so you won't watch the adverts, but hopefully you can see it's working there. Uh, and I'll just close that down. 
and you can use anything you can go to the live categories and um, they'll all work and i'm using remember i'm using nordvpn the same vpn service i just switched to one of the optimized servers and that will uh, yeah. oh, sorry and then i was just watching live there and hopefully you can see that there as well um you'll get adverts in on any of these but um if you upgrade to premium you can get rid of the adverts but this is live tv this is itv1 some quiz show tipping point and that's all there is to it so remember cookies delete your cookies always delete your cookies it's not always cookies but it, it's worth deleting them and secondly ip address now if you're using a different vpn service to nordvpn just try switching servers, you know, try a different IP address. You'll find some work and some won't. Why I like NordVPN is they make an effort to just tell you which ones do work, okay? They don't make any um, secret that sometimes they get blocked, but they try and optimize a specific number of servers. I think they're about, it's about 20% of their um, UK IP addresses. Okay, right, I'm going to close that now, and hopefully that will help you for explain if you're having trouble with your VPN service not working with ITVX. Okay, thank you very much for watching, and have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.